Hello and a very warm welcome. What a crazy Sunday yesterday as Manchester United and Liverpool both got destroyed. Manchester United lost at home 6-1 and then Liverpool went and did even worse and lost 7-2. We played the majority of the game with 10 men. Liverpool had a full man squad. Wow, 7-2. The Premier League, it is the best league in the world, the most watched league in the world, the best like talent comes to the Premier League, everyone wants to play in the Premier League. It's absolutely madness. Like these results are crazy. Who would have predicted Liverpool and United to have got destroyed like they did? Everton sat at the top of the table, four wins out of four. Aston Villa, who nearly got relegated last season, smashed Liverpool. 7-2 and have won 3 out of 3. Everton and Aston Villa are the only teams that are still unbeaten. It's just absolutely madness. Couldn't believe what I was watching yesterday. But this is why we love football. Because the craziness of it, Manchester United and Liverpool both getting humiliated. Wow, 25 goals in 5 games. It was an epic day for football yesterday. And as if you're a neutral fan and you don't support any of them clubs, you got unbelievable entertainment. What a crazy day. The Premier League is amazing. I think it is just a blip for Liverpool. I w would not be shocked if they won the league. But just 2020, it's been an absolute crazy year with COVID. And the Premier League season is... Produced absolute carnage on Sunday. That day will be remembered as a United fan and Liverpool fan for all the wrong reasons. But if you're Tottenham and Villa, wow. It was an amazing day for the Premier League. Obviously, I'll bring this out Monday. The transfer window closes today. Will Manchester United be doing any business today? Last day of the transfer do that massive build up on Sky Sports all day it'll be covered on Sky Sports but wow what a day for the Premier League now we go on shitty international break I hate international football uh, two weeks till we back in Premier League action but what a day yesterday I'm, I'm shell shocked like it's just finished Super Sunday you had Leicester, Leicester getting smashed by West Ham, then United getting destroyed by Tottenham, and then Liverpool getting destroyed. It was absolutely madness on Sunday, the 4th of October. That date will be remembered. And maybe the Premier League's open this year. I mean, Everton looking superb with their new signings. Decore, uh, Allen. James Rodriguez, Aston Villa nearly got relegated last season, now the top of the league. It's going to be an epic day today with all the transfer business and hopefully United can make some signings after the shit show that was yesterday. But any signing we make now is a panic. They should already be through the door. They're not through the door. And we're panicking. Edison Cavani. Uh, Alex Tellers because we've missed out on our prime target Jaden Sancho we missed out on him so now we're panicking and it's shown start of the season we've conceded 11 goals in 3 games should have lost every single game wow let's see what happens on deadline day what a crazy Premier League weekend wow Everton Top of the league going into the international.